Hi guys! Okay, so I haven't made a makeup tutorial in a really long time, so I just kind of felt like, why not? Also, I'm going to be using a lot of my new Coastal Scents makeup because a lot of people ask for that. I will be using my Coastal Scents 88 palette, but if you don't have that, just um, look through your makeup and see if you have any colors that are similar. I've already done my foundation. Um, it's the same exact thing that I do every single time I do my foundation. So I'm not even going to show that, but I will show you what I'm wearing. It's just a really simple like coral pink shirt. And then below that I'm just wearing um, jean shorts. So it's just a really um, simple outfit. It's nothing special at all. I'm not really doing anything that interesting today, so I don't feel like I need to be wearing an awesome outfit. And Enjoy! Okay, same thing as I always do is just prime your eye. And that's just a simple, like this, on each eyelid. Rub it in. The first thing I do is take eyeliner. This is Revlon Color Stay. It's one of those twist ones. Okay, and also, I don't want anyone commenting on my eyebrows. I know they look terrible. Believe me, you don't have to tell me, um, but I did just make a wax appointment, so please don't comment anything to do with my eyebrows. Um, they're going to be fixed soon. So I'm going to take my eyeliner, and I'm just going to line the waterline. Just like that. Now I'm just going to take my Coastal Scents brush, this is the dual end one, the top is an eyeshadow brush for like your lid, and the other side is just like a crease brush. I'm going to take my Coastal Scents palette, this one right here, it's three in, the fifth one down. So it's a pretty bright coral color, it's this color right here. I'm going to pat this all over my eyelid using the dual end brush. Since it is such a vibrant color, you don't really have to pack it on that much. Okay, so the coral is on there, but see how it's such a harsh line? I'm going to take my um, Coastal Scents, I forget what this is called, go watch the haul and I'll definitely say the name in it. And I'm just going to blend out the edges because it's kind of like too straight so if you just blend it out a little. Now I'm going to take the crease side of the brush. I'm just going to take like a bronze color. This is my favorite bronze color right here. It's a really shimmery um, golden color right here. So it's three up and it's one over. So I'm just going to take this crease brush and pick up some of that shimmery gold and I'm just going to put this in my crease. Just like that. Now I'm going to take here, It's this is the bright color we used first, that's the second color that we used. And I'm going to take this top color on my same eyeshadow brush that I've been using. I'm going to pat it right in the middle. Depending on what your skin color is, you can take any of this in this last row over here because they're all like skin tones. So I'm just going to start here and just bring it up under my eyebrow. Okay, so this is what the eye looks like. I'm sorry that the lighting just like really drowns out the color. It's so much more vibrant than it appears on the camera. Now I'm going to take my Copper Penny pencil. I'm going to take the lighter end which is like the light gold, and apply it from here to here, and a little bit up here. And now I'm going to take the darker side, which is this side, and I'm going to do it from here to here. And just to make sure, this is under your lash line, and my black liner is on my waterline, so it's not like you're going over your black liner. So that's the eyes, and now I'm just going to take my um, 
Great Lash Mascara. This is in Blackest Black. And don't forget to do your bottom lashes because you don't want to have it really long top lashes and then like no bottom lashes. That mascara just like amped up my lashes so much. Okay, now I'm going to zoom out a little. Now I'm going to take my flat brush and I'm going to be taking my Maybelline Dream Mousse Blush. This is in the color Rose Petal. It's just a really pretty pink, which is perfect if you're wearing like pink because it's just like really cute and pretty. I'm going to dip my brush in. A little and all I'm gonna do is just like sweep it over my the apples of my cheeks like this for the finishing touch just take some blistex chapstick this is in silk and shine because a lot of people comment on um, my beauty videos and say my lips look dry but they're I don't know they're not though I just don't get it they just look dry um, and then I'm going to take my coral funk this is a Coastal Scent Smack. I'm just going to apply it to the middle. And then, go like that. So this is the final eye look. Oops, it's not focused. There we go. Okay, so it's pretty subtle, really pretty coral pink. Um, it does have some bronze blended out, so it's not like a harsh color line. I really like this. See you guys later. Thank you for watching Beauty Lovers and bye guys!